Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel. If this is your first time here, welcome. And if it's not your first time here, thanks for coming back. So today I have another Walmart haul for you guys. This is a big one. This is a big one. I went a little crazy. I just love, love Walmart's clothes and shoes right now. So I picked up a bunch of stuff. I'm gonna show it to you now, give you my thoughts. Let's get to it. All of the products that I mention in this video, I will link below in the description box, as well as all of my sizing information. So if you have any questions about that, refer to the description box. Okay, I'm gonna start off with the outfit that I'm wearing right now. I am loving this outfit just for a super like everyday go-to spring summer outfit. So it's this neutral ribbed top from the brand Free Assembly and it is like this cream oatmeal color. I got my normal size small in this and if it's good, it's not cropped. It's a good length that you can tuck it if you want to or just front tuck it, which I did with the outfit that I'm wearing right now. I love the neutral color, obviously. Like I've been really into these very neutral, basic tops that you can just pair with a lot of different stuff. You know what I mean? I will say it does feel kind of cheap, which is surprising because Free Assembly generally is supposed to be like a better quality brand at Walmart. So I was a little surprised with the material. It feels very thin, but I still like it. Like it's very lightweight and it was obviously not expensive or anything like that, but I just wanted to throw that out there. It is a very thin top and almost like one of those ones that I feel like if you wear it a few times, it's gonna stretch out and not keep its shape. So, uh, you know, whatever, I can deal with it. I like the top enough that I can deal with it. And then on the bottoms, I'm wearing cargo shorts. Guys, cargo shorts are back. Do you love it or do you hate it? I kind of love it. Like I so remember wearing cargo shorts, cargo pants when I was growing up as like a preteen in the late 90s, it was the thing. And so I am, kind of loving these shorts. They're very comfortable. They're from the brand Time and True. I got these in store actually, but I will of course check to see if they're online. I got my normal size four and they fit perfect. They come with this adjustable, again, very nostalgic sort of belt that would come with cargo shorts always. So you can either sub it out for a different belt or you can just take it off altogether or you can leave it like I did. I kind of feel like in this outfit, like a zookeeper. You know, I just need like a zookeeper hat and some boots and I'm good to go for Halloween. But I like it. I don't know, I just really like the vibe of this outfit. Earthy tones, easy, flattering. I love it. For shoes, um, every single pair of shoes that I'm wearing in this haul are from Walmart. And I featured all of the shoes that I'm wearing in my most recent video, which is my best shoes at Walmart right now. So I will link that video down below if you didn't see it. So I'm not really gonna go into the shoes in this video. Of course, I will link all the shoes in the description box below though. All right, my next outfit. I have this crocheted hoodie from Sofia Vergara. So I love crochet, like crochet is having a moment right now. Of course, with summer coming, it's very breezy, it's very like vacation-y. I do really like this hoodie. Um, I kind of wish I didn't get this color. It's a little too like yellow toned for my skin tone. I feel like it almost washes me out a little bit, but it does come in other colors. I did get my normal size small and it fits really nice. One thing I'm not like a big fan of is the sleeves. They stay the same width the whole way down. And for me, that's more of a pain. Uh, I feel like my hands get caught in my sleeves or if I'm eating, like my sleeves get in my food. Small pet peeve. Really, it's just like a preference thing. Other than that, I think this is a really cute hoodie. <laughs> and with that hoodie, I paired these denim shorts from Sofia Vergara. I featured these in my last Walmart haul, which I will link down below if you haven't seen that. And I'm still loving them. I won't go too deep into discussion because I already mentioned these in my last haul, but these are the Lila short 
And these are quote mid-rise, but I actually think they're pretty high mid-rise. I don't really usually like mid-rise, but I do like these shorts. They've got a nice amount of stretch to them that they'll be able to keep their shape and they're a little bit longer length, which I think is good for somebody like me who's not 21 anymore. I like that it has a little bit of length to them. So I am a big fan of these shorts. Okay, and next up I have kind of like a big combo of things. <laughs> I have a two piece set, but I actually have three pieces. So I have this tie up top from Sofia Vergara. I have this tie up top from Sofia Vergara. And it is just this really like cute, almost sweater material, but very lightweight sweater material. This does come in another color as well, but I got like the more neutral, taupey brown color. It's cute. I had a really hard time tying this on me so that my bra wouldn't show. So I would say if you don't mind going braless, this would work really nice. Um, and it is a small, but it's quite large on me. So I thought that was also interesting. I would probably size down in this one. And with that, you have two choice of matching bottoms. So I bought both. Why not? You know, this is how much I love you guys. I wanna try them all out just so you don't buy something you don't like. You know what I mean? I first paired it with these lounge type of shorts. I love these shorts. They're super comfortable. Again, they're not super short, which I really appreciate. And the leg is a little bit looser, which I like because I have kind of more like muscular legs. I don't have really skinny legs. So sometimes these types of shorts will catch on my legs or like sit weird on me, but I really like the shape of these shorts. They're really, really nice. I got my normal size small. So I would say stay to your true size on these and you'll be good. Now I will say I didn't necessarily really like the tie up top with this. I probably would pair this with the sh even the shirt that I'm wearing or just like a tank top or a t-shirt just as like a casual loungewear look. Again, personal preference. And then the third option was this midi length skirt. I really didn't like this on me. I am five foot four, but I have really short legs and a long torso. So this hit me at just a really weird length. It was not a maxi, not a midi. It was just weird. I honestly felt like I had a towel wrapped around my waist. That's exactly what I felt like in this. <laughs> so not, not really a look I'm going for. Um, I would say if you are tall, like, five, seven and taller. This is gonna be a really cute like midi length on you. So just keep that in mind. For someone who's five, four or shorter, I really don't think this is a flattering type of skirt, personally. I got my normal size small and it was a little big actually even in the waist. So I would probably size down if you want it to hit you more at like your waist rather than your hips. So overall, this was kind of a fail. I thought the pieces were gonna look cute together. But then I had the thought of pairing the tie up top with these pair of jeans. Because I like the top, but I just didn't like it with the other two pieces. So these jeans, okay, I have seen these jeans talked about so much all over social media. I had been watching for them to go back in stock because they went out of stock. They came back in stock. They went out of stock again very quickly. They never came back in stock in the short length, which I really do prefer. I really prefer my jeans that are on the baggier side to either be like a cropped length or long enough that I can wear heels with. I don't really like it to be in the middle. I did purchase them in the regular length. I read the reviews and it said to size up one size. So I did, I am normally usually a size four and I sized up to a size six. I will say when I first got these and I put them on, they fit perfect, but I've worn them a few times now and I feel like they're stretching out more and more, which tends to happen with more of a stiff denim which these are more of a stiff denim. These are the original 90s straight. I do really like these jeans, so they are super cute, like relaxed fit type of jean. And all I did to make it more ankle, ankle length is I rolled the bottoms up a little bit. So 
that's a good look too if you want to show your ankle. Overall, I probably will try to pick these up in the short length whenever they eventually get back in stock, if they ever do. All right, my next outfit. This could be a cute workwear outfit. I have already mentioned these pants in past Walmart hauls and I still love them. I still wear them all the time. These are from Time and True. They are the... I don't know what they are because they're not written on the tag, but I will of course link them down below. They are just these skinny pant. I think they're meant to be like capri slash ankle length. On me, they fit like full length pants, but I love them because they've got no pockets. They've got no front zipper. So they're very streamlined. You can put any shirt on top and it's really just gonna be seamless. I have them in several colors now, so. You're gonna see another pair later in this haul, but these are just the plain black ones. I really, really like these. I do think that not all of these pants are created equal. The ones that are more printed, they seem to have less stretch. So I would say for the solid or definitely at least the black, you can get your true size. I got my true size four and they fit. The other ones with prints, you probably wanna size up because they're quite snug. So anyway, love these black pants, continuing to wear them. Love them, love them. And I paired this top with the pants. I thought this was fun. I love stripes. I love like a relaxed fit top with a tighter pair of pants just to even out the proportions. I do feel like a slight bumblebee in this with the yellow and black stripes, but it's still cute. I like it. So this is from the brand Sea Wonder. I have never bought anything from the brand Sea Wonder before and I was happy with the quality, it's very nice. It's almost like a linen type of material which is cute for spring and summer. It has a drawstring that you can tie. It is a, it's not a working, oh no, it is a working drawstring. So you can adjust the ruching and it's buttoned all the way down the front. Very cute, got my normal size small, it fits great. By the way, if you don't already follow me on Instagram, my Instagram handle is at Rachel Palmieri. I'm active on my stories over there and I tend to show things right away that I find are really good or really bad. So if you are interested in getting like immediate updates with things, check me out on Instagram. All right, another potential workwear outfit is those same pants from Time and True. I got my normal size four and these ones are definitely a little more snug than the black ones. Now it may just be that I've had the black ones longer and I've worn them more that they've stretched out. That is entirely possible. But I love this like window pane print. It's very classy. It classes up just a regular pair of pants, makes it look a little more professional. These are good year round and you really can pair any kind of neutral top with this or even a pop of color with this and it would look super cute. And with that top, I mean, no, bottom. With that bottom, I paired this top from Sofia Vergara. And it's this like peasanty gathered in the middle type of top. You know, we're seeing these tops all over everywhere right now because they're in style. Very cute, just a basic black drapey top, but it does give you shape because it has that gathered ruching in the middle and it brings your waistline in, which is nice. It is a little bit on the see-through slash not greatest quality side. I will say that, but it's cute. It's cute for a black basic top. I did get my normal size small and it fit me very well, I must say. All right, and this outfit, you guys, I love it but it just didn't work out for me, unfortunately. Well, half of it didn't work out. So these pants, actually, they're the exact same, I didn't realize that, the exact same material as the last black shirt I was just showing you. These are from Sofia Vergara. These are just like very vacation-y, summery type of pants, you know? You can wear them with a pair of wedges and just like a simple top and a sun hat and you just look tropical. This does come in other colors as well, but I just went with my normal go-to black. These did not work out for me, unfortunately, because they were just far too big lengthwise and in the waist, I got a size small. I should have gone down to an extra small. I think I will buy them in an extra small because I really like them. <sighs> so size down, 
definitely. And if you are petite, these are definitely not gonna work for you if you're shorter than me, because even with heels on, they were far too long on me. But I'm hoping the extra small is gonna work. If not, I'll just get them tailored. Very cute, vacation-y, flowy pants though. Love them. And with that pair of pants, I pair this Sofia Vergara bodysuit. You guys, this bodysuit is so amazing. I like it better than I've gotten bodysuits from American Eagle. I've gotten bodysuits from Abercrombie that were far more expensive than this. And I prefer this one. Extremely stretchy, but not see-through. Really nice. You're able to wear any kind of bra with it because the, the straps are thick enough. It has a thong back, which I prefer, so you don't see the lines of the bodysuit. I got my normal size small and it fits me perfect. Now, I did say earlier, if you were listening, which I know you were, but I'll repeat myself anyway, I have definitely more of a long torso and a lot of bodysuits do not fit me. Like the leg holes come up like to my bra, <laughs> not quite, not quite that bad, but I have a really hard time finding bodysuits that fit me lengthwise and this one fits me perfect. If there's anything from this haul that you buy, it's it's this bodysuit. And I actually also got it in this nude color and it's not see-through. If I wear a nude bra under it, you can't see the bra. And I'm really excited to wear this like underneath things like this that have that crochet sort of see-through. I can wear this underneath it and it camouflages, of course, anything underneath but it's also just tucked into my pants, so it's like an invisible layer. Love it. Okay, and then the next several items are dresses. So the first dress is this yellow dress from the brand Scoop. This is a cute dress. It's not really my style personally, but it is cute. I love the color. Like yellow is so in right now. It's very spring, very summer, of course. I like the embroidery detail on here. It just makes it a little more elevated and more expensive looking than if it was like a screen printed thing, obviously. The tassels are really cute with the multicolors. It does have a slip inside, so that's nice. The material is quite thick, not so heavy, but definitely thick and really good quality. Of course, it is the brand Scoop, so it is a little more expensive than say Time and True. I like the tears on it. I would say if you're pregnant, this would be really, really cute on you. It's just for me, not, not my style, but if they're your thing, you, you will probably enjoy this because it's a nice quality dress. I got my normal size small and it fits great. Okay, and then this dress, this is definitely more my style. Actually, this is exactly my style. Black, bodycon, good length for me. I love this style of dress. This one is really not for me. I don't love it. It is extremely itchy, that's the first thing. And also it is pretty cheap and like see-through. The quality's not there. This is Sofia Vergara and I actually got an extra small because I just wanted to make sure that was tight enough on me. I think the size fit me great, so I would say size down, but actually don't size down, don't buy this dress. It's, it's, not, it's not good, it's very itchy. <laughs> and it covers a lot of your body, so that's a lot of itchiness going on. Unfortunately, it didn't work out for me. Okay, this dress is my favorite. Favorite. Okay, I know I said I'm over tie-dye, and I am, but this is a, this is a little different type of tie-dye print to me. It's more stripey, and it's pink, so I love pink, I do. It's kind of hard to see here, but of course you're gonna see the try-on. It is a wrap style dress. It's not a true wrap style because it does have a panel in the front and then you just have a piece, like an extra piece of cloth that you tie over to the side. So that's nice if the wind is blowing or something, you're still covered. The reason I love this is for two reasons. The fit of it is just like perfectly flattering, just really kind of sexy, which I like. Not super oversized. And also the material is so soft. It's a jersey material, but it's doubled. So it's, you know what I mean? It's this and this. So it's two pieces of jersey back to back. So it's not see-through and it feels good quality and thick, but very, very soft. I just really, really, really love this dress. 
I got my normal size small and it just fits me. If I eat a big meal, it's probably gonna be too small. So I would say if you're in between sizes to size up, otherwise get your true size and just know that it is very, I think it's meant to be like a tight fitting dress, but very cute dress. It's from the brand Scoop. I don't know if I said that. Okay, and then this dress is also from the brand Scoop. This is definitely more of like an oversized flowy type of fit, but it has the spaghetti straps that are adjustable, which is nice. Very cute floral print. And it has what we call a shark bite hemline, which I haven't seen a shark bite hemline since the early 2000s. So it's longer on the sides and shorter in the bottom, which is again, just different. It definitely gives it more flow. I think if you were tall, this might be a little too short on you, but for me, I thought the length was perfect. Again, it's from the brand Scoop and I got my normal size small and it fits me perfect. Very cute. I could even see this as a swimsuit cover up, easy to slip on and off at the pool or at the beach, but also just like a really cute dress if you have like a baby shower or a bridal shower coming up this spring or summer. All right, and my last item I did not try on because this, I feel like this is definitely meant to be a swimsuit cover up or it's meant to be a tunic shirt because it is very short in the front and I'm not tall. And also because we were, when we were shooting the footage for this try on, it was extremely windy and it just, it would have been bad. So anyway, I do like this dress. Yeah, this is definitely supposed to be a swimsuit cover up. I remember now I tried this on it here at the house and the crochet detail comes like really, really low. So I don't see like wearing a bra, like a normal bra with this or anything. It, it would be really cute as a swimsuit cover up though. Super just like peasanty, but black, which I love. Long sleeves, definitely like a lightweight material with the tassels, very cute. I'm sure it comes in other colors. I got my normal size small and lengthwise, like I just said, it's pretty short, but otherwise it fits me great. And I really think this is super cute for summer. Oh, and that's it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, I would love for you to subscribe. I upload videos weekly, beauty and fashion videos. Guys, I just, I'm really loving Walmart stuff. I think it's beating the hell out of Target. That, that's just my opinion. All right, you guys, thank you so much. I will see you next time. Bye.